What is up guys, Poch here and in this video I'll be upgrading this PC with a budget of 10k. Spoiler alert, I had a CPU bottleneck problem because I paired the CPU in this PC which is an i3 second generation that only has 2 cores and 4 threads with an RX 470 4GB variant. A CPU bottleneck happens when the processor isn't fast enough to transfer and process data. To further explain about CPU and GPU bottleneck, I'll put a link to a website that I got the information from in the description below. What we have in here is an i3-2100 that has 2 cores and 4 threads, with a base frequency of 3.1GHz. Paired with it is an Asus P8H61M M80X motherboard and a single stick of 2GB DDR3 memory. This PC used to have a GT710 and a generic power supply, but unfortunately, both died. So the reason why we decided to just upgrade this PC instead of buying a new one is because of our tight budget. And in a way, it would also help the environment by reducing e-waste. For the parts to upgrade this PC, we have a Sapphire RX 470 4GB variant for the GPU. As for the RAM, I'll replace the single 2GB stick with two sticks of 4GB DDR3 memory. For storage, we have a 120GB SSD for the operating system and a terabyte of hard drive for mass storage. Powering this build is the EVGA 500 BV bronze rated power supply. For the case, we have the Rack Marug from Rack Gears. Paired with it is three Keytech RGB fans and two generic fans from my old PC build. A total upgrade price of 11,580 pesos, but you can still lower the price if you go with the less powerful GPU and a less powerful power supply. In my case, since I had a CPU bottleneck problem, it would have been better if I got a less powerful GPU. Later on this video, I'll show some benchmarks. So without further ado, let's get into the video.
as you saw from the benchmarks, there was a CPU bottleneck. I think it would have been better if I paired a less powerful GPU like a GTX 750Ti or a GT 1030. I'll do more future videos about the RX 470, so subscribe if you haven't. Now, would I recommend that you upgrade your PC? Well, it depends. There are things to consider first. One is to consider the specs of your old PC. If it has an old generation i3 or an AMD CPU that only has two cores, I wouldn't recommend it. Since nowadays, a 4-core, four 4-threaded four CPU is the required minimum. The second thing to consider is what do you plan on using it for. If you plan on playing modern games like Call of Duty Warzone and Cyberpunk, it would be better to invest on a new PC. For productivity like video editing and rendering, it would also be better to invest on a new and powerful PC. But if you plan on using it for normal web browsing, I think upgrading it would be fine. Lastly is your budget. If you have a budget to build a new PC, then go for it. Just remember to consider on what you plan on using it for. And please do research about it. And of course, as with any advice, please take it with a grain of salt. And that's it for this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. If not, give it a thumbs down. Subscribe if you haven't. And I'll see you on the next one.